Got a 2021 Ram 1500 Laramie Edition. Today I'm going to be showing you how to mount the flag right there on your sliding glass window. Here's the flag I'm going to be using. In the video description, I have a link to where you can purchase your own. Good thing about this flag compared to the other one I had in my previous video is this one is when you mount it, you can still see through it. The other one you saw the stripes and the stars will block your view. Also, the other one didn't last. Took it to a car wash a couple times. And being that they were individual slices right here, your lines, the water pressure shredded it. First thing you're gonna wanna do, I just washed this car, but as you can see, the window's still dirty. I'm gonna hit it with the glass cleaner, clean it real good. Next thing you're gonna wanna do, Take rubbing alcohol and clean over everything you just did again. Okay. Let me show you. This is the most important step is getting it 100% as clean as possible. No lint, get a lint free towel. Clean all your corners as good as you can. Clean, lint free towel. Put your rubbing alcohol on it. This step right here, after this, I'm doing it, but you don't have to do it because it's winter time right here. It's 27 degrees out. I'm gonna hit it with the heat gun just to heat up the glass, okay? So when the glass is hot, your decal will stick even better. and warm, you're going to get a spray bottle of water, and you're going to spray water mist, the light mist, on your glass, okay? This is to help when the line in the decal. Decal, you're going to pry it back. Take some water and you're gonna spray the back of the decal as well. Very light mist, nothing crazy. You're take your flag and you're gonna line it up as center as possible to the glass, like so. Before you press it down, you're gonna make sure it's lined up good. Like so, you know, you can see this bag is okay. It has air release pockets, little pockets here. So you're not gonna have any, any air bubbles. You're gonna slowly work your way down, pressing evenly from side to side. Like so. smooth now you're going to use the provided squeegee that comes with it take a little more water mess the outside kind of 
stiff, squeegee, and work out always to the corners, from the center to the corner, the top and up. And work out any little bubbles, which you ain't gonna get much, being that you have all these tiny holes to let the air out. Like I said, being as winter time, I'm gonna go one more step and I'm gonna heat up the decal and squeegee a little more. So you get better adhesion. Whenever you're heating up any decal, you don't wanna keep it the heat in one spot for too long. And you don't wanna heat it up that you're melting the glue or the decal. So I'm gonna go just like this. Up and down. And I'm gonna squeegee at the same time. That's how you install your black and white decal. No air bubbles, good quality film, car wash safe. Like I said, the other one I had, your stripes were independent of the white. So as the water hit it and the scrubbers hit it, it shredded it. But being that this is one unit, it's going to last, trust me. Here's a close-up look at it. You can see where the air releases from the decal, so you have no bubbles. And it's smooth, and it's see-through. Give you a look from the inside. This is a really cool decal here, as you can see. Can't even see it from the inside facing out. Okay. Hope that video helped you. If it did, subscribe, give me a thumbs up. I'll have a link in the description of where I purchased this.